Hey gang, here's a super fast introduction to how you can make a parallax effect in After Effects. These are great for making promotional footage or when you just want to show off your photos in a really cool way. You're going to want to start with getting your pictures in your work area properly situated. Then you're going to want to right click and go to New, Camera. Click OK and now the View in Your Project window should shift to viewing through the lens of our camera. Now in order to properly record any footage with cameras in After Effects, most assets need to be converted to 3D objects. To do that, go over here and click this button next to any assets you want to convert. If you don't see it, just go down here and hit this button that says toggle switches and it'll pop up. So now that our camera is viewing a 3D version of our image, let's go into our camera's transform controls here and look at what we want to mess with. For something simple like what we're doing, I think we're just going to adjust the position and the Z rotation. So let's make a keyframe at the beginning of our timeline for position and Z rotation. Now move to the end and let's set Z rotation to negative 5 and the Z axis for our position from negative 400 to negative 2100. That's just what my dimensions are. Yours may be different, but all I'm really doing is making the camera zoom in and twist to give us a little bit of a Dutch angle. That's looking pretty good, so let's keep it going by adding some texture. I've got my dirt texture JPEG right here and I'm just going to drop that in. Now when you start working with multiple assets in 3D, it helps to have multiple points of view. So to do that, go over here on your preview window and change it from one view to two. Mine defaulted to top, which is great. By selecting it in this window, it gives you a bird's eye view of how your layers are arranged. Now I'm going to set the dirt textures blending mode to multiply and scale it appropriately so its edges aren't visible from the front. I'm also going to set its opacity to 40, just so it isn't too distracting. Now I'm going to make some position keyframes on it so it'll slowly zoom in as the camera moves closer. That's really going to enhance the depth of this piece. Let's go ahead and do the same thing with this grime texture I have. Same deal, make it a 3D layer and this time I'll set its blending mode to screen. Scale it appropriately and set its opacity to about 60%. I'm dragging it out on the position again but I don't want it to come as close to the camera so I'm going to have it stop right here at the same time as everything else. And just for fun, let's also have this one rotate a little. At the same points where the positions move, I'm throwing in some Z rotation keyframes, and by the end, I'm going to have this one rotate 120 degrees. That's looking great! Let's wrap up by adding a light leak. I got this from our cinematic light leak pack that you can find over on our website. They look so freaking cool, and once you have them, you can just drag and drop them right onto any project. So I'm going to do just that, and for a light effect like this, you don't have to worry about making it 3D. I'm setting the blending mode to screen so you can see everything, and then I'm going to click right on it and go to Time, Enable Time Remapping. And I'm going to wrap up by stretching it out on the timeline and then moving this keyframe to line up with the ones from the other layers. And we're all done! I'm loving how this came out, but what if we wanted to push it even further? Well, Josh has an absolutely fantastic tutorial on the same subject over on the Sonduck Film Channel, where he goes into even more depth about what you can do with a parallax effect, including how to transition from one photo to another. Seriously, go check it out, you won't regret it. If you're looking to save time and produce awesome work right here in After Effects and Premiere Pro, check out our links below to get access to our Motion Duck extension, which contains thousands of editable templates that are easy to update and ready to go for any commercial, client, and personal project.